Hey guys, today we're going to go over a good mobility drill for the overhead squat for the snatch. So a lot of people can't overhead squat and can't do a full squat snatch at all. Some people kind of can, but they don't feel very comfortable with movement. So today I have my friend Orion here, fellow coach and competitor at CrossFit Yukarhu. He's going to go over the overhead squat mo uh, motion while I talk about it. So Orion, go ahead and do, do an overhead squat. Let's take a look at it. Let's take a look at it from the side here. And just go down there and hold it. So notice how Orion's torso is leaning forward, the bar is kind of back behind his head, and his shoulders are internally rotated. Go ahead and come up. So remember that position. He's gonna go down and hit that again. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna focus on a couple things. You can go ahead and relax, Orion. So I'm gonna work on getting his torso more vertical. So instead of leaning forward here, he's gonna be nice and straight up and down. Um, we can see the logo on his chest because before it was kind of pointing towards the ground. That's going to be um, straight ahead. Also with his shoulders, instead of having internal rotation that looks like this, I'm going to pull his shoulders back so that way his armpits are facing forward and he has good external uh, rotation in his shoulders so that way he can secure a better elbow lockout when he goes overhead. So go ahead and go down again, Orion. So he's forward. And the further forward you lean, you also can't get your hips down lower. So what I'm going to do is come up behind him and put him into position. So Ryan, it may feel like you might fall when I stretch you, but I'm not going to let you fall because I'm going to hold you up. So I'm going to take my knee and I'm going to put it in the small of his back very gently. And I'm going to push his hips down and then grab him by his shoulders and pull him back slowly into position. So from there, I pull on his shoulders just like that get him more vertical. From here, I'm gonna push straight down on his traps, just like that. What that's gonna do is activate his mid-back and get his scapulas down and depressed. Orion, go ahead and lift your scaps up, push your shoulders up. So you don't wanna push your shoulders up into the bar like this, you want your shoulders down and depressed and activated and have a good elbow lockout. So where Orion's at right now, he has vertical torso, he has external rotation, his armpits are facing forward, and he has a nice tight lockout. Go ahead and push up against the bar, Orion. I'm going to push down on his traps some more to make sure his mid-back is nice and tight, everything's activated, and let's go ahead and come up. Good, and relax for a second. So sometimes you have to do that with athletes, you have to put them in the right position because giving them a, ver a verbal cue isn't enough. If you say knees out, or chest up, or straighten your arms, they may not know what a good lockout is. If you tell them straighten your arms out for me, they may be here, so I have to go up to them, push on their elbow and tricep to get them to a full lockout. So Orion, go ahead and do, do a few overhead squats for us. Let's see how it looks. So focus on keeping that chest up, external rotation of the shoulders, and go down as low as you can. Do two more. So as you can see, Orion actually has pretty good mobility. I just had him kind of lean forward for me at first in the video to show you where most people start with their overhead squat. So the goal is to get where Orion is. Every lifter is different, everyone's overhead squat is going to look different too. So what that means is the goal is to try and get as close to vertical as possible, have external rotation, and a nice tight lockout with the elbows. So that's our mobility drill for overhead squats. I do that with all my lifters, and every time we do that before they lift, their snatches feel way better, and it's great to do every single day before you train because it will improve mobility in the long run.